Hi guys, question 5, Biology 2016. The presence of Kitty on earthworm is for dash. The presence of Kitty on earthworm is for dash. Option A, respiration. Option B, reproduction. Option C, excretion. Option D, locomotion. Please note that the examiner is trying to test you on a topic known as movement. Another word for movement is known as locomotion. Therefore, the question is asking us something about earthworm. Please note that earthworm uses kitty for locomotion. Another name for kitty is known as bristle. Please note that respiration is a process by which organism they produce energy by the oxidation of glucose. Every living cell undergoes respiration. Reproduction is a process by which organisms give birth to organisms of their kind. That means organisms must reproduce their kind. C, which is excretion, is a process by which organisms remove metabolic waste material and materials in excess requirement from their body, whereas locomotion is a process by which organisms move from one place to another. The question is asking us something about locomotion, and locomotion in earthworm is by the means of kitty. As a result of this explanation, the correct option is D. Thank you.
Hi guys, question 3, 2016 biology. The relationship between a herbivore and the bacteria that lives in its cocoon is dash. The relationship between a herbivore and the bacteria that lives in its cocoon is dash. Option A, commensalism. Option B, we have parasitism. Option C, we have mutualism. Option D, we have saprophytism. The question is testing you on a topic known as association among living organisms. The reason for this association is that organisms can derive benefits from each other as well as also give and take relationship. Now please note that commensalism is a relationship between two organisms in which the host gives all the benefits to the commensal and the commensal never causes harm and injury to the host. Parasitism, on the other hand, is a type of association between a host and a parasite. The parasite causes harm and injury to the host. Mutualism is a type of association between two organisms in which both of them benefit. Saprophytism is an association that involves only one organism in which that organism feeds on dead and decaying organic matter. Please let's look at the question one more time. Please look at this question. The relationship between a herbivore and a bacteria that lives in the cacum is dash. A herbivore is the name given to an organism that feeds on plants. Why the bacteria that lives in the cacum of that herbivore will help the herbivore to digest the plant that is being fed upon by the herbivore. In a way, it means the herbivore and the bacteria are living in a relationship known as mutualism because the organism which is a herbivore does not have enzyme known as cellulase. The enzyme known as cellulase help to digest the cellulose in the plant that the herbivore has eaten. Therefore, is the work of the herbivore to eat the cellulose containing material which is later digested by the bacteria. Bacteria derives benefit from the herbivore because the bacteria lives in the cacum of the herbivore. As a result of this explanation, it means that the relationship between the two is known as mutualism. The correct option is C.